This is a 2021 show coach. We just completed a little over a month ago. $2,122,678. What is going on everyone? It is a beautiful day here in Miami, Oklahoma. And right now we're standing inside of a 2021 Newell Coach that I had the honor to test drive. Thanks again, Josh. Huge thanks to the team at Newell Coach. Still have a smile. Yeah, I'm still smiling from ear to ear. Huge thanks to Josh and the team at Newell Coach here for letting me drive this coach. We did show you the coach with the slide outs in. Today, we're gonna show you the coach with the slide outs out, give you the full tour. Josh, what's going on in this coach, sir? This is a 2021 show coach. We just completed a little over a month ago, as we talked about when you drove it. We did notice uh, whenever you had in, we had 12 inches of walkway space was our tightest point. Now look at it with our 30 inch opposing slides and the height of our slides are actually 78 inches, six foot six inches, which is one of the tallest slides in the industry. Gives you a lot of room to stand around. Good standing room, not just good floor space. We did a lot of cool things with this coach. Uh, this is more of a, um, a show coach that uh, mainly built more for couples. We don't have bunks or anything like that in it, but we do have additional seating and additional sleeping here. Such as you do have a high to bed sofa right there by Villa. Um, pulls out, makes a nice little air mattress for you, queen size air mattress. And you have the recliner right here with the big screen TV up top. We did not put a uh, TV lift in this particular coach right here up front. In this feature right here, we have some little additional storage. Good storage right here. Uh, some people may be in a show coach, we can add some adjustability into it. They might want to put a rise up desk there, or they may want to put a wine cooler or something like that there. We also have a nice little credenza here with some really good storage. Maybe if you want to, some people like to have a printer, keyboard, stuff like that. 170 degree recliner, which pretty much about you can lay flat. You see, we do have our big windows here. We do have a uh, Couple cool little features here if you like little window accent lights, red, green, blue. And we also have that on the awnings, the window accents, the belt rail, and underneath the coach. So if you like to have a little pop, be noticed in the campground, you can easily do it in this coach. Or you can just simply turn them off and be kind of subtle too. We have some new sconce lights right here. We just started running. They are a 12 volt sconce light, which can really work if you need to be boondocking or something like that. It makes life a little easier for you so it's not drawing as much power. So we come through here, uh, we have a great, what we call a bow out curve uh, galley right here with a 30 uh, inch Advanium, G Advanium microwave convection cooktop. Here we have a lot of different um, storage opportunities, storage things here. You have a good trash can and up here we have good space for um, plates, things such as that. You know, you got the saucer storage so things might not slide around as much and won't break. And we do have a little lip here so things don't slide out. Come through here, we're a little bit of a smaller sink in this one, which really gives us the advantage of having good countertop space. Um, we have a two range induction cooktop. We do offer bigger ranges and we do offer bigger sinks. A lot of people may like the farm sink, but really to be honest with you, the smaller sinks are becoming more and more popular because people like to take advantage of the countertop space. Have your Intrepid system right through here, our Intrepid 2.0. I think that we've gone through a lot of that before. You can operate this from here on your phone and we have two iPads throughout the coach as well. You can pretty much, this is the brains of the coach right here. Very, very user-friendly system. This does extend out. This table does, and it's really pretty cool. It's just a little simple push of a button right here. And uh, it comes all the way out, um, and we have the leaves and everything and the inserts underneath the uh, bed. You see with our dinette slid out, we can sit six people very easily. We can also sit six people up front in the uh, living room area. Three on a couch, and these uh, driver passenger chairs spin around, and the bigger recliner makes it really, really a nice feature. Everybody can sit comfortably. Not Everybody don't feel like you're on top of each other. With our big window, it just kind of adds to that. This right here is a little glass cabinet, I guess you can probably call it wine station, drink station or whatever, but uh, it's nicely well lit up. This is pretty cool. This is a plumbing um, coffee maker right here. We have the Keurig attachment right here. Oh yeah. Right there. And uh, 
But if you noticed when I was up there showing where the plate storage was, you saw a big coffee pot. So you can do either or. We have the Keurig or the coffee pot, and all it is is just pulling this thing out and putting another insert in. This is our uh, G uh, monogram refrigerator. Pull on it. See how hard it is? I mean, you got to really... Wow. What that's for is a lot of people, we do have a taller refrigerator than most because we have 89 inches in here. Coach has a lot of storage. You have a little laundry hamper right here. It's a pretty tall laundry hamper because your washer and dryer is right here. And I really love this feature of how we can push, how we push our doors back because it really, really opens the space up. And with the pocket door being right here in the bathroom, no doors are going to collide at all. You see right here, we do have our air pocket door right through here. Wow, I really like the pattern that you guys used on that door. And I've got to also point out to air doors are great, but in an emergency situation where that isn't functioning right, there is an emergency door release right here. Now, is there also another emergency door release from inside of the bedroom? Yes, most definitely. We have a couple of different spots. For instance, this one right here is for your bathroom area. In your bedroom area that right there will release the air in this door and this door now okay cool so what this is right here is so the kids can't really know where it is we got a little secret door right there and anytime you see a red in an emergency door release that's what that is right there because sometimes people may be walking out of the bathroom and might hit the door lock button or something like that as they're shutting it and sometimes lock it but in case that happens and you're stuck in the bathroom, we also have another one back here as well. Okay, cool. So, I've, got, <laughs> I've got to, but we want to make sure we're covered here. All one, two, three pocket doors have an emergency air release. Awesome. You saw three of them, and so that's three right there. And while we're back here in the bathroom, let's go and show a cool feature we did yeah. on this coach right here. You see the back vanity area right there? That's something new. Oh, for yeah, us. look at that. I'm going to close this up that, here. Uh, Grant's wife, Amber, uh, actually came up with this idea. Uh, just a little something um, for the ladies to have little their own little space. Oh, yeah, look at but that. You nice so little, when you open that up, it's one. got that nice lighting around the way there. All of these different compartments to put your jewelry or makeup. And there's even an outlet inside of here just for, you know, I don't know what you'd plug in there, but whatever the, the gals are using, maybe a hair straightener or something. I don't know. Yeah, something. I mean, hey, they always have a lot of, and you go into a bathroom, you see a lot of appliances laid out everywhere. <laughs> so we have a lot of plug-in uh, plug outlets here throughout our bathrooms. But uh, this right here, you have really good storage, medicine cabinet storage in this coach right here. And you also have a 110 outlet up there as well. We put a lot of 110 outlets here in, in kind of hidden places just because in a bathroom, most people put their stuff away, but they just want to plug it in temporarily. It's not in the kitchen. They might leave a toaster oven out or something like that. This right here, you have the um, towel warmer. Yep. If you need it. Nice. Some so, storage. Yes. Yeah, this, this is a cool right feature. So you turn on your towel warmer. Imagine getting out of this beautiful shower and having a warm towel waiting for you and while i'm looking at that i've got to point out how cool this pattern is yeah. on the whole bathroom wall here it goes behind the towel bar as well beautiful styling and of course these newell coach sinks are, are always a really cool design and you have a lot of countertop space we here we have a lot of countertop space in this particular bathroom because we extended it out a little bit so we could put that vanity area in right there and it really was too tight to put two sinks in, so why don't we make a bigger one sink area? So we made this more like a residential style sink, not small at all. So you have really good countertop space in this coach between the back bathroom and the galley area. Remember we showed that in the galley area with the smaller sink. Yeah. So um, this is actually one of our bigger showers. You can always tell that if you're looking at a dual coach, if this right here has a little bit of more of a gap, if it's smaller, that's how you can always tell the range of a dual shower. We come in here, it's got dual shower head, so, and that's a rainforest style shower head. You've got a vent on the ceiling with a fan, but it's got this cool aesthetic cover to cover that up. Beautiful design here. Really large surface with the really large grains in it. Different than the tight tile that you would see in other coaches. This is a cool design. And then the other thing Newell Coach is doing that I really like is you don't see a drain here. Like where, where did the drain go? Well. If you look really closely, you can see a small line right there, and that's going to be your drain. All right, I just got to press this pocket door just yeah, for fun. Yeah, pocket. This is something new. Have, you, have I, we gone through that yet? 
Um, I don't know. I just wanted to press the button. It's just, I'm like a kid. This right here is something new we're doing. Um, in our bathrooms now, we have a little panel. And what it does is, if you want to get a little to your screens, your shades, and it just makes it a little bit bigger and easier for some of the customers to see. It's really user friendly, but you can adjust the screen brightness and all that. You can easily turn it off completely if you want to go to bed like you can with your panel lights here as well. Yeah. Um, we've been working with Spider on that and they've been doing a great job. Come up with some new uh, user friendly ideas for our customers. And some of those features are featured right there in the bathrooms because really you only have so much wall space in a bathroom. The bed right here is, is it, actually tucked in. Is it bigger than a king size bed or is that a king size bed? This is a king size. What it actually does is it, it's going to extend out. We uh, bring our stuff in because we usually, our beds in because we usually have three inch in depth slides. So therefore, when both slides are in, it's pretty tight fit, but we won't be able to shimmy around, which is what we talked about during our test drive video, the importance of walking around. How are we able to do that? We make our own mattresses here at Knoll. And what we do, we do a little flip up right here. And we just kind of oh, yeah. back on in. Nice. And therefore, you have an 80 inch long bed. Nice. And But most of the time we're showing coaches and stuff, we tuck it back in to give you as much room as possible to walk through. It's pretty easy to do. All you do is, is lift it back up right here. And put it in. Nice. One other thing I've got to point out that I really like about this coach is the color of the tile here. Just a beautiful floor here and it's all flat floor. So you notice you don't see where the slide outs are, all the same floor. Um, even into the, the, even the half bathroom has that same floor, but the rear bathroom, a lot of these Newell coaches, they kind of go a little more extravagant with the rear bathroom floors. Uh, just just a really neat design how it all ties together. And I'm just noticing all this cool stuff that I want to get a close up of. All of the stitching here and these wall panels and the lighting. Just a, just a stunning design in this coach. And then we do have the fit screen TV with a nice sound bar kind of hidden right there. I don't know if you saw that. Oh yeah, I didn't even there. notice that. It's yeah, so... Good so surround subtle. sound bars, really. Um, and we kind of hide it, but we make it look nice and clean as we do to continue with the trim work right through here. And always, like I said, we try to give you storage wherever we can. Um, you see right through here, I don't know if really you can look up here, but look at the ceiling package we did right here. It uh, kind of yeah. matches with the floor. You know, a nice ceiling design in it. And then it's also still really easy to get to our AC units right through here. You can change your filters and everything out very easily as well. We have some uh, other cool features outside of this coach. It does have a pressure washer with the iodized um, resin tank. So therefore you have to sprout free water, 25,000 pound towing capacity. Um, this coach also features our new gear, the 427 gear, which Andrew showed you during the test drive, how well it picked up and maneuvered around. Um, all in all, this is a really great coach. This is the last 2021 show coach we're going to have available for this year. So, uh, it's for sale and it's ready to find a new owner. You can uh, contact me at 704-657-1783 or check us out at, w at www.newellcoach.com. Hold on, not so fast. Oh, I'm sorry. How much money? So <laughs> last 2021 show coach available. I got to put you on the spot. Oh, yeah. What's, what's the sticker price on this coach? The sticker price on this coach right here is $2,122,650, I believe. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. If you want... To know more about this coach, please call me at 704-657-1783 or visit us on our website at www.newellcoach.com. Josh, can't thank you and the team at Newell Coach enough for letting me and the folks on YouTube see this incredible Newell Coach. I appreciate all of you liking these videos and subscribing to the channel. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again.